Well, happy Thursday morning, everybody. I'm your student meteorologist, Jillian Bohennick, here with Penn State's Campus Weather Service with your forecast. We do have some things to cover this morning, so let's get right to it. We are looking at the current conditions outside now, as you can see, it is a very nice morning out there. We do have that sunshine starting to come in, so it is going to be a decent day, even though it's going to be quite chilly today. We are sitting at about 10 degrees this morning, and it feels like zero. And we do have those light winds, which is making it feel colder than it actually is. We are going to look at what we have here with the temperatures. That light blue color represents temperatures at or below freezing. So as you can see, the entire state is at that temperature, so below or at freezing. So we are going to see that for the rest of the day today. But luckily, things are going to start to look up. But for right now, in the northern tier of the state, we do have those single-digit temperatures. We are looking at 5 in Scranton, 9 in Williamsport, and 9 in Erie. But as we do get lower into the state, we do have temperatures in the teens, and then we do have our warm spot in Philadelphia. And we do have the Doppler radar here. As you can see, out to our west, we do have some bands of snow, but those are starting to fizzle out as they approach our area, so we won't see any precipitation today. We will see some sun and possibly some clouds passing in through out today. And then on for tonight, we do have some passing clouds moving in, which is going to drop our low to about 17 degrees, but that is still warmer than it was last night when we were in the single digits. And then for tomorrow, we do have partly sunny skies, but luckily it will start to warm up as a high pressure system will start to move out tomorrow. So we do have temperatures in the upper 30s and we may even hit that 40 degree mark. And now we're gonna take a look at your seven day forecast for today, again, we do have those partly sunny skies. Temperatures are still sitting about 12 degrees below average, but then by tomorrow we will have temperatures start to pick up as we will see temperatures in the upper 30s and we may hit 40. Saturday, we do have a possibility of a few snow showers later on in the day as we do have a cold front going to be moving in into Sunday. And that is going to be the story for early on on Sunday as well as we do have a chance of some flurries. But by Monday, we will start to see things look up once again as we will see temperatures in the mid to upper 40s Monday and Tuesday. And then again, Wednesday is our next chance for some precipitation and we will see some temperatures start to dip back into those seasonal averages. But it isn't too bad of a week if I may say so myself. And just don't forget, Saturday, Saturday night into Sunday, before you hit the bed, make sure you spring ahead an hour as it's daylight savings time. So make sure you set your clocks ahead an hour and enjoy that extra hour of daylight. Once again, I'm your student meteorologist, Jillian Bohenick here. Thanks for tuning in with us this morning. And as always, stay classy and have a great spring break.